here at KHOU, we love those who are standing for Houston in tonight. Another example of that. Yes, this is so cool. Ron Trevino is now here. Ron, you're working on this story about a cleaning service in Conroe who's offering free house cleaning to women fighting cancer? That's right, this is a story we're working on for six o'clock, Jason. It's a great story because they see the need and they've been doing this for a few years now. The, the company is called Maids and More. They're in Conroe, they're headquartered out of Austin, but their Conroe office for the past couple of years yeah. has yeah, been on. offering their services free of charge to women who are battling cancer. Now this is a money-making operation, so uh, they're a regular cleaning company, but they have uh, uh, coordinated with a group called Cleaning for a Reason, which is a nonprofit, and they get them in touch with women who are battling cancer. And we meet one of the patients tonight, one of the customers, and uh, she talks about, you know, what this means for her. And the simple, something simple as yeah. just oh. cleaning a house. Yeah. She's battling cancer. She doesn't even have the energy to lift a broom. Yes, the last thing she wants to do is scrub anything, exactly. a countertop. It's it's so wonderful. So of it's them a big to need out service. there. We'll, we'll be talking about that at six o'clock and what this means for the people who do the cleaning too. They get something out of this too. I bet you they do. Yeah, I'm All sure right. they feel good about it. Tonight, we're happy to share with you a company that is standing for Houston, a cleaning company up in Conroe. And the company is donating its services to women battling cancer. Ron Trevino joins us now from the newsroom with this story. Hey there, Ron. Hey, Len and Mia. It seems like such a little thing, but this is huge. A company sees a need and tries to answer the call to help women in the fight of their lives. It looks like a typical morning. Hey. For the cleaning crew from Maids and More of Conroe. Good to see you. <laughs> you too. But today's job is far from typical. They're doing it free of charge, and they say it feels awesome. It really does. Awesome. <laughs> I'm so glad that y'all did this. Brenda Yingle has been battling cancer since last October. It's left her so weak at times, any simple task is impossible. Having her house cleaned for free so she and her husband can concentrate on her recovery, well, it's priceless. When my daughter said she found this company, I was like, you know, even one day will help. It'll help me. It'll help me physically, but it'll help me mentally. The company Maids and More teams up with a nonprofit cleaning for a reason to offer free house cleaning to women battling cancer. It's not only helping the patient, but it actually helps our morale. Our staff love it. They really like to come in and feel like they're helping somebody. Everybody has somebody with cancer. I've got several people I know and have that's had cancer. So it feels really good. It feels like, you know, I can't help my people. But it always feels good to help other people. I see a, a, a definite change in my, my wife, Brenda. Mrs. Yingle is feeling better these days and optimistic about someday. Thank you all so much. Being cancer free. Now, Maids and More says the need is huge and that other companies need to step up to the plate. I got a feeling, I got a feeling it probably will be after tonight. Let it me up. That's fantastic. It looks like a typical morning. Hey. For the cleaning crew from Maids and More of Conroe. Good to see you. <laughs> you too. But today's job is far from typical. They're doing it free of charge, and they say it feels awesome. It really does. Awesome. <laughs> I'm so glad that y'all did this. Brenda Yingle has been battling cancer since last October. It's left her so weak at times, any simple task is impossible. Having her house cleaned for free so she and her husband can concentrate on her recovery, well, it's priceless. You know, even one day will help. It'll help me. It'll help me physically, but it'll help me mentally. The company Maids and More teams up with a nonprofit cleaning for a reason to offer free house cleaning to women battling cancer. It's not only helping the patient, but it actually helps our morale. Our staff love it. They really like to come in and feel like they're helping somebody. Everybody has somebody with cancer. I've got several people I know and have that's had cancer. So it feels really good. It feels like, you know, I can't help my people, but it always feels good to help other people. I see a, a, a definite change in my, my wife, Brenda. Mrs. Yingle is feeling better these days and optimistic about someday. Thank you all so much. Being cancer free. And how about that? Maids and More has been helping out women with cancer in their area for the past couple of years now. They say they hope other companies will see what they do and want to help in their own areas as well. Good day, Maine. 
Well, one Houston company is trying to make a difference for women battling cancer by helping them clean their houses for free. Good Day Maine's Ron Trevino shows us the company answering the call to help those who are fighting for their lives. It looks like a typical morning hey. for the cleaning crew from Maids and More of Conroe. Good to see you. <laughs> but today's job is far from typical. They're doing it free of charge, and they say it feels... Awesome. It really does. Awesome. <laughs> I'm so glad that y'all did this. Brenda Yingle has been battling cancer since last October. It's left her so weak at times, any simple task is impossible. Having her house cleaned for free so she and her husband can concentrate on her recovery, well, it's priceless. You know, even one day will help. It'll help me... It'll help me physically, but it'll help me mentally. The company Maids and More teams up with a nonprofit cleaning for a reason to offer free house cleaning to women battling cancer. It's not only helping the patient, but it actually helps our morale. Our staff love it. They really like to come in and feel like they're helping somebody. Everybody has somebody with cancer. I've got several people I know and have that's had cancer. So it feels really good. It feels like, you know, I can't help my people, but it always feels good to help other people. I see a, a, a definite change in my, my wife, Brenda. Mrs. Yingle is feeling better these days and optimistic about someday. Thank you all so much. Being cancer free. It's such a blessing. Thank you for having me. You don't want to miss this story. It seems like such a little thing, but a clean house can make someone who has cancer feel a little bit better. Yeah, absolutely. That's why a company in Houston, Texas is helping people in the fight of their lives. It looks like a typical morning. Hey. For the cleaning crew from Maids and More of Conroe. Good to see you. But today's job is far from typical. They're doing it free of charge, and they say it feels awesome. It really does. Awesome. <laughs> I'm so glad that y'all did this. Brenda Yingle has been battling cancer since last October. It's left her so weak at times, any simple task is impossible. Having her house cleaned for free so she and her husband can concentrate on her recovery, well, it's priceless. When my daughter said she found this company, I was like, you know, even one day will help. It'll help me. It'll help me physically, but it'll help me mentally. The company Maids and More teams up with a nonprofit cleaning for a reason to offer free house cleaning to women battling cancer. It's not only helping the patient, but it actually helps our morale. Our staff love it. They really like to come in and feel like they're helping somebody. Everybody has somebody with cancer. I've got several people I know and have that's had cancer. So it feels really good. It feels like, you know, I can't help my people. But it always feels good to help other people. I see a, a, a definite change in my, my wife, Brenda. Mrs. Yingle is feeling better these days and optimistic about someday. Thank you all so much. Being cancer free. That's a great it's service. I mean, beautiful. Not, and you know, I mean, just to have someone come in and do that for you, it just yeah. gives you a little bit of break, a little yeah. stress, takes a little bit of the stress away. Absolutely. Something that you don't have to think about. One less thing that you have to think about. And clearly, it's a sweet relationship, too. It's yeah. not just all about the house cleaning. So, big very hugs sweet at the end of the day. Yeah. Yeah. A Houston area company is donating its services to women battling cancer. Ron Trevino shows us how the company wants to give those customers a breath of fresh air and a sigh of relief. It looks like a typical morning hey. for the cleaning crew from Maids and More of Conroe. Good to see you. You too. But today's job is far from typical. They're doing it free of charge and they say it feels awesome. It really does. Awesome. <laughs> I'm so glad that y'all did this. Brenda Yingle has been battling cancer since last October. It's left her so weak at times, any simple task is impossible. <laughs> Having her house cleaned for free so she and her husband can concentrate on her recovery, well, it's priceless. You know, even one day will help. It'll help me, it'll help me physically, but it'll help me mentally. <laughs> The company Maids and More teams up with a nonprofit cleaning for a reason to offer free house cleaning to women battling cancer. It's not only helping the patient, but it actually helps our morale. Our staff love it. They really like to come in and feel like they're helping somebody. Everybody has somebody with cancer. I've got several people I know and have that's had cancer. 
So it feels really good. It feels like, you know, I can't help my people, but it always feels good to help other people. I see a, a, a definite change in my, my wife, Brenda. Mrs. Yingle is feeling better these days and optimistic about someday. Thank you all so much. Being cancer free. Thank you for having me. It was Ron Trevino reporting. A cleaning company in Houston is helping the community by donating services to women battling cancer. Ron Trevino has more on that act of kindness. It looks like a typical morning hey. for the cleaning crew from Maids and More of Conroe. Good to see you. <laughs> you too. But today's job is far from typical. They're doing it free of charge and they say it feels awesome it really does awesome <laughs> i'm so glad that y'all did this brenda yingle has been battling cancer since last october it's left her so weak at times any simple task is impossible having her house cleaned for free so she and her husband can concentrate on her recovery well it's priceless when my daughter said she found this company i was like you know even one day will help it'll help me It'll help me physically, but it'll help me mentally. The company Maids and More teams up with a nonprofit cleaning for a reason to offer free house cleaning to women battling cancer. It's not only helping the patient, but it actually helps our morale. Our staff love it. They really like to come in and feel like they're helping somebody. Everybody has somebody with cancer. I've got several people I know and have that's had cancer. So it feels really good. It feels like, you know, I can't help my people, but it always feels good to help other people. I see a, a, a definite change in my, my wife, Brenda. Mrs. Yingle is feeling better these days and optimistic about someday. Thank you all so much. Being cancer free. It's such a blessing. Thank you for having us. I love that story. Just a little thing, you know, to the cancer patient and just saying, you know, that just helps solves all my problems for today. I don't have one less thing to worry about. Right. An easy gesture goes such a long way. Exactly. You can see.